Hello and welcome to a really quick unboxing of the Turnergy Nanotech 200mAh 1S 35-70C to LiPo battery. So this battery is intended for the Inductrix or also known as the Tiny Whoop. And it's a little bit bigger than the stock ones. And it comes with a little protector here. Just remove that. And hope we can always put these stickers on here. Can remove them. Yeah. Okay, so let's get started with uh, the comparison to the older LiPo's I was flying. The 25C one was the stock one I bought the Inductrix with. Then I upgraded to again Horizon Hobby the 45C versions. They are both 150 milliamps and going from the 25 to the 45C it's like it feels lighter, it's slightly heavier, but it feels lighter. But going from the 45C um, e flights to the Nanotech 200 milliamps, it does feel heavier. I wasn't um, expecting that. It, it still has really good punch. I have the upgraded motors from Banggood in mine. And yeah, it, it does feel a bit heavier, but flight times are so much longer. So I. I'm really convinced this is the right LiPo to go. I haven't tried the My LiPo LiPos, everyone seems to be flying, but I think don't buy this one. You can buy this one and you can buy that one. And that's like, I'm, I'm not sure, I don't want to lie, but I think it's like three times or more the price of this. I think I paid like three to four euros, so that's like four, four bucks or so. So let's get some weight measurements going here. They do fit quite tight in the in here, since this is designed for ugh, the smaller lipos, I guess. But you don't have to jam them in really far, since the uh, the case will fit it like this. So let's start with the lightest one. So that's four point three six grams. Then. The 45 CE flight that's 4.51 grams and the 200 milliamps nanotech 5.28 grams. So that's actually. Ah, okay, yeah, I was confused. Yeah, so it's, it's a good bit heavier, but that's to be expected. I mean, it's like one third more weight, uh, more milliamps. Yeah. So just for thrills, put this on here, 19.13 and with the, oops, uh, with the lipo, 24, well that's not bad for all up weight, isn't it? And I have the flex mount, this is actually the, uh, the flex filament from Hobby King and I really like it, It's it feels super flexible, but it it just takes a beating. It's really great. I love it. And it prints really nice. I mean, it's it's not the most beautiful print I ever done, but it's like not much trouble to print it. So that was actually longer than expected. Just get some size measurements really quick. So width shouldn't be that far off. 11.35 millimeters compared to 10.92 and 11.25. I mean, this is obviously gonna flex a bit. And let's look for a length. I will not include the connector. I will just go from plastic to end. 43.85. Forty one forty four two and last but not least thirty seven point five seven. So you can see it's actually really really some size difference there, but 
It still balances out nicely, so you can fly acro or manual. It's, yeah. I recommend it. So much for the unboxing. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.